This activity is called Breaking Out. It is designed for learn to train development stage players 8 to 12 years of age. It focuses on the decision making and recognition of opportunities when players can penetrate by running with the ball. The equipment required for the practice include three sets of coloured pennies, 12 markers to lay out the three zones and six size four soccer balls. During the practice, the coach will show progressions of the practice to further challenge the players as they improve. It's important to note the following, how the coach engages with and involves the players during the practice, the four corners of development, and at the end of the practice, how the coach asks the players to self-reflect on what they have just worked on. So we have four red players here, You'll see four orange pennies there, that's the red, okay? We also have four blue players here, that's the blue in the middle. You'll notice also that each of the blue players have one soccer ball. See that? And you'll see a ball beside each penny. We have four green players, over there you'll see four green pennies, and there's one soccer ball with green, and one soccer ball here with orange, okay? So blue, can you see the zone? They're going to play in between the two red lines. So if I'm a blue player, can I borrow your ball? All I'm doing, just like this, dribbling my ball nice and slowly, all around inside this zone, I can zigzag, I can go different directions, okay? So that's what blue are going to do inside this zone. Orange, you're going to spread yourselves out, right all across this area. You're going to pass the ball amongst yourselves. You're going to pass it, yeah, until Maybe one of you, pass, pass to me, oh, until we see a space and I can dribble, I can dribble across to the other side and get in this zone. Now I play with the green team. Green, you're trying to get to that side, dribbling the ball if you find a space. Okay, off you go, play! Emphasis for the coach includes creating a safe environment, questions to the players, allowing the players to make decisions and demonstration of the activity. Now you play with two balls here, Orange. There's a ball, there's a ball. Play, play, play. Good. The outcomes for the technical corner, passing, good, receiving good. the ball, well dribbling the and running with the ball. Yeah, yeah, just, just straight, straight, straight. Good, good. Good, good. And freeze. Well done. I want to ask you a question. Well, why did you decide to run through there? What told you that's a good time to run through? What did you see? Because uh, everyone was over there and I saw space. A big space to run through. Good job. Good job. So excellent idea. Saw the space. Was able to dribble into the other side using that big space. So let's switch up. Blue and you come here. Leave your ball. Green in the middle, all the green players in the middle. So green, you're going to dribble inside the center. Are we ready? Off you go, play. Oh, nice, right away, dribbles across. Good, yep, good, pass it till you see a space. Good, good. The outcomes for the physical oh, good, corner, balance, running, good. change of direction pass it, pass it. and speed. Keep it inside your zone. Good. And freeze. Good. So Ellie, what happened there? Yeah, so maybe wasn't enough space, eh? So if there's not enough space, maybe I just keep my ball. So if I have my ball and I see, oh, oh, there's lots of people here. Who in my team's in lots of space here? Luca. Luca. So look, if I give it to you, what would you do? Show me, Luca, show me. Yeah, now Luca can dribble across because he's in space. Okay? Just come, can we have the ball here, please? Good. And come on back on, come on back on this side. Good, Luca. Off we go, play. So try and find those spaces. Pass it, good. Pass it, Luca. Good passes, Luca. Pass it, pass it. Who do you see? Good. The outcomes for the psychological corner include safety, creativity, confidence, spatial awareness, and having fun. 
and freeze. Good. So maybe just to help a little bit, can I have the ball please? Is this a good position to try and dribble through? No, not really. So I've had a look. I've seen all oh, lots of people in my way. If I pass it over there, better position to dribble through? Yeah? Why? Because lots of space. Lots of space. How can you help me so I know you're in lots of space? Sorry? You could call me. You could call, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'll pass you the ball. You're in lots of space as well, aren't you? So maybe we can help each other by communicating with our teammates. So for the last minute, let's try that. Okay, let's see if we can communicate better if we're in good spaces to dribble the ball across. So important to do what when we're trying to be successful when running with the ball? Yeah. To talk, to communicate, what else? Yeah. Keep my head up to see what? Yeah. To see spaces. Do I have space I can run into? Okay, so well done.